Hello, hello, my good farmers. Here is your farmer, K farmer. Welcome to my episode on onion farming. Today, I want to take you through an aspect of uh, onion curing and uh, what it takes to have good, medium, and sizable bulb. This block is a uh, 0.96 of an acre that we planted around 286 uh, pieces of onions. Uh, this stage we are, we are in the week 11. The only thing that is remaining with the, our onion is drying up and now we will be harvesting in the next two weeks. This is my product. You can look at my onions over here. Uh, this is red wave. It gives me very good clear uniform bulb. And as I have been telling you about my previous episode, Onion farming is about density and uh, the population. In my bed, one meter bed, I make sure I have four drip lines. So in total, I have eight lines of, of onions. Once you look at it, now the other aspect is about was about spacing. We do a spacing of between eight or ten centimeters from one crop to the other, so that your crop can be can have the correct density. So we are going to have such beautiful onions over here. Even you look, if you look at the same, the adjacent bed, we have uniform bulb. And uh, some of you are asking, is it possible to get 20 tons in one acre? It's quite possible because if you have your onions of this size, look at my onions. Allow me to pluck two onions here. Because uh, they, are, they are ready, just look at them. I can do another, another small, smaller, medium type. Here you go. These are big bulb that I planted at a spacing of 10 centimeters. This is another one. You can see they are good, they are firm. We are just waiting for them to cure. In the next two weeks, I will be in the market because the only thing that is remaining in this bulb is a uh, drying of this vegetative part. The secret in this is one is the spacing, the other one now is feeding. Your crop, if you count the number of leaves in, in here, meaning your crop is healthy, this one will translate to the numbers of layers that will appear in your bulb. So it is very important for you to feed your onions well so that this this is the factory, the vegetative part is the factory of this bulb. Once you make sure that your nitrogen is okay, your phosphorus is okay in the soil, definitely you're going to get such sizable onions. I'm expecting that when I use, when I'm harvesting like these onions that are medium sized, 12 of this will give me one kg. About four or five of this will give me one kg. About eight of these onions will give me one kg. Uh, if my population is about 3,000, for 300,000, sorry, for example, what do you expect? I'm going to have a tonnage of about 20 or 18 tons in this acreage. One thing that we need to appreciate with farmers is agriculture as a science and as an art. Uniformity is very key. All my bulbs will have the same size because we tried as much as we could to make sure that uh, our spacing is correct. So I'm about to go to the market. Here farmers, the, your starting point has to be very very keen. Do not compromise on anything. Success is in the details. Make sure that those women that are going to plant for you the onions, they are not wasting the seedlings. You are transplanting uh, rate should be almost a hundred percent. What you are taking from the nursery should be exactly what you are going to transfer in your main bed. And by that you are going to have such uh, beautiful onions and uh, the market If you have a tonnage, a good tonnage, definitely you are going to, to break even and you are going to have a good profit margin. So they are the same. This is a 0.3 acres. This is a 0.3 acre and another thing, 0.3 acre. For me to be in the market for a period of time, I plan.
add my onion in a spacing of two weeks you can see this is about to mature I have another block here that will be maturing so when I start harvesting in uh, end of this February of 2022 I can assure you that I will be in the market for up from February up to uh, June because my planting program is that so what helps me to understand uh, when to plant just doing a small analysis on uh, on the trend of market in our country or in your country where you are you know when the demand is high when the rain for patents happens and that one will guide you on your on when you plant in our country kenya january march april up to june that is the best time to In, uh, this is my foot which we use in uh, one meter in one meter this is my one meter you can show them up to here let us be a little bit uh, practical this is one meter I'm having one two three four five six seven eight nine nine onions and there are eight lines so nine by eight uh, that is 56 56 onions if I divide by 12, if 12 onions give me one thing, in one time you can know what you're going to get. So thank you very much farmers. Soon 